When you hold the box to a 10 and a half inch stargazer in your hand, it does not fit your expectations. It's light, which is a lot to say for a piece of cookware that's known for being heavy. Something about the way it sits in the box makes it feel incredibly well balanced. It's sturdy, and I feel like if I dropped it, it wouldn't do much damage to the contents. In fact, the shipping box had considerable damage to it, which did not translate to the product box. For as stout as the packaging is, it's also not confusing. One flip of the box, a slice with a knife, and you're ready to open. I had seen other videos unboxing this piece of cookware that showed it sort of floating around in the box with a puck of seasoning wax tossed in. Let me tell you, those days are gone. The skillet now sits securely in a factory formed cutout with an extra piece of cardboard securing the handle. The skillet is wrapped in cellophane and has an incredible set of stickers and magnets to go with its care manual. You immediately feel an intangible difference between cheaper cookware and the Stargazer. The attention to detail makes this piece of cookware a showstopper. The forked handle for cooler handling, the thumb groove, and the flared rim that allows for pouring on any side. The only real dilemma I see is finding a way of showcasing it, because this thing does not live in a cupboard. I cannot speak too much to the performance of the Stargazer because I haven't spent enough time with it. But check back for a six month follow up. I purchased the bare version of the cookware because I want to have this thing as my daily driver for the next six months or so. So I wanted to make sure it was treated right with some Buzzy Wax Green Blend to ensure the best results. I want to give a huge shout out to Stu over at Stargazer for hooking us up with this skillet to review. Be sure to subscribe to Cast Iron Community for more Cast Iron content and share this video with other Cast Iron enthusiasts in your life. Until next time, keep cooking. This is Cast Iron Mo. Bye.